Hey everybody, my name is Dr. Andy Rosser and today I'm going to be going over some pretty simple techniques for using this tool which is called the stick and it's something that I use every day in my office but something I think that you can use at home as well and uh, be pretty effective for working on trigger points, tight muscles, fascia, different things like that that can be slowing you down. So hang on for just a couple minutes and we'll go over how to use this. This is the stick. This is the stick. This is the stick. This is a stick. This is a stick. This is a sticker. So, now that we're going to use the stick instead of a stick, we've got to match up our techniques. This is what it looks like to use a stick, even though he's got the right technique. Same thing, using a wrench, right technique, wrong tool. We also got to be careful about the technique, even if we've got the right tool. Shouldn't hurt. This looks like it hurts. It does. Let's match up the technique with the tool. Now we've got some nice moderate movement along the long axis of the muscle, starting with the quadriceps. We're going to go for 15 to 20 strokes over that area, 15 to 20 strokes over the IT band. Lifting the leg up there helps that muscle relax on the side so you can work on it without the tension of the muscle contracting. Next thing we're going to do is underneath the hamstring. Same thing, lifting the leg up keeps that muscle nice and relaxed while you're working on it. Last thing you need to do when you're working on the trigger points is to fight against your own muscle contraction. So lift that leg up, working on the inside of the thigh, you can rest the leg down on the ground. Same thing following the long axis of the muscle, 15 to 20 strokes and then you're done with the upper leg. the lower leg we're going to work with the front of the leg first a little bit of an angle so you're not rolling on the shin bone 15 to 20 strokes over that area flip around to the back work on the calf 15 to 20 strokes you can find some tight spots in there you just work on them nice and slowly moderate pressure when you're done with that switch sides do the opposite leg and you're all done if you have any questions about this technique feel free to give me a call Check my website out, rosserchiro.com. Thanks for watching.